Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Kurt T-Connector vehicle wiring harness with the four-way flat trailer connector. Now this is a custom fit part. It is designed to fit the 2019 Mazda 3 vehicles. And on a custom fit part like this, I always like to recommend for you to go to our website, use the fit guide, put in your year and model vehicle, and it'll show if this will work for your application. Now this harness will provide this four-way flat trailer connector at the back of your vehicle power your trailer signal lights and it is compatible with five pole, six pole and seven pole adapters that we do sell separately on our website. This will connect very quickly and easily. Basically you just locate your connection points which are behind the tail lights of your vehicle. Plug in these T connectors, one on the driver's side, one on the passenger side, ground your white wire, then run your black power wire to your vehicle's battery. Now it does include this black box here which is your tail light converter. This is to ensure that your vehicle's wiring will match that of your trailer. It is a powered module. That's why it run, connects directly to your vehicle's battery, and they do that to avoid overloading your vehicle's electrical system. This converter is constructed using SMT technology, which is surface mount technology. Gives you more consistent, reliable performance. It will maximize your trailer light yield and intensity while producing minimal heat. It also ensures nice superior operation in any rough road conditions. Now this kit also comes with this nice rubber dust cap for your four-way. And what's nice about that, you can just attach it to the four-way. <clears throat> and you can leave it on there if you want. And then when you're not plugged into your trailer, just take your dust cap, put it over the terminals, and it'll protect them from any damage or from the elements. A few specs on this harness. The maximum amperage for the stop and turn light circuit is 5 amps per circuit. Tail lights is 7.5 amps per circuit. Does come with everything shown here on the table. Comes with a nice set of detailed instructions that will describe how everything installs and pictures of where they connect. But just briefly to go through the connections on these, what you'll do again is go to the rear of your vehicle, access behind the tail lights, and you'll probably want to start on the driver's side and take the wire that has the yellow and red in it, that's for the driver's side, unplug your harness, plug this T connector in line there. And then what you'll do is take the other T connector with the green wire, that's for your passenger side, run this length of wire over to the passenger side, plug this in behind the tail lights. <clears throat> and then this converter box, it does have a little weight to it, so you do want to attach that to a good flat surface so it doesn't bounce around. They do have a tab on it with a hole that you put a screw in if you want, but they also give you this nice double face tape, double sided tape that you can put on there and attach it down that way run this bonded wire with the four-way out towards the trailer and then you'll have two remaining wires the white wire you can see has an eyelet on it that needs to connect to a good clean ground if there's one nearby if not they do include this grounding screw that you can make your own ground and then the remaining wire is your power wire this needs to run to the vehicle's battery in the front they do give this length of wire and the connectors to do that so if you take a butt connector connect it to one end of this length of wire run it all the way to the front. Now you don't want to run this correctly to the battery, you want to run it through the inline fuse holder. Take the other butt connector, connect it to one side of the fuse holder, just like that. And then on the other side, take the eyelet connector, attach that, and then connect it to the battery. Pop open the fuse holder, take the included 15 amp fuse, just install it into the fuse holder, just like that. Put your cap on, and your system's all ready to go. If you notice, they do include some extra cable ties that'll help keep up, take up any slack in any of the wiring. But that should do it for the review on this Kurt T-Connector vehicle wiring harness with the four-way flat trailer connector.